say that I'm not a very emotional person, but everybody's emotional. You may not be expressive, but you're emotional. Sometimes men say, well, women are so emotional. Well, you're emotional too. What happened when you hit your thumb with the hammer? <laughs> you may not have went, woo, woo, woo. But emotion came up, and stuff started coming out of your mouth. <laughs> You're emotional too. We just may express it in different ways. But everybody's emotional. Everybody's emotional. Well, God not only cares about our salvation, God not only cares about our health, but He cares about our heart. He cares about our emotions. Our emotions. Many of us make decisions that are emotional decisions. Many of the decisions we make in life, they're not really logical decisions. They're not necessarily the word of God at all. We're making decisions based on how we feel about things. And some of those decisions are because of fear. We're afraid something might happen, or we're afraid we're going to miss an opportunity. I'm afraid I'm not going to find anybody else. And fear causes you to make your decisions. Sometimes it's worry. Sometimes it's shame-driven. Sometimes it's insecurity, sometimes it's anger, sometimes it's frustration, sometimes it's stress. And we make decisions to try to alleviate the stress. The American Psychological Association and the American Institute of Stress in New York say that 48% of people lie awake at night because of stress. They said that 33% of the people that they surveyed said that they're under extreme stress. Well, you know, that kind of emotional pressure causes you to make certain decisions. But the problem is, when you make decisions out of emotion, it generally leads to more difficult situations 